talk more about what was underneath, because that was quite important. Right, well, we'll talk about that later. We will be seeing Dave later on in the programme, but for now, I think Steve's got his head in a toolbox somewhere. Steve? I'm here. Assures me that everything's the same as any other motor. Is this true? It is true, <laughs> except that obviously things are a lot bigger in this car. Yeah. You're dealing with a, a V8 engine and 6,000 odd something or other litres or whatever they call it, you know, power. And uh, also, there are things which I obviously do on a, a daily basis. Um, yeah. Checking fluids, for instance, there are twin fluid top-ups here for the brakes. There are twin carburettors which need topping up with yeah. fluid on the top. Uh, distributor cap, like any other car, which has eight outlets, which you need to sometimes clean. Uh, but the beauty of this, this car is where roll score is. They think of things like, you know, how to stop breakdowns. And they've twinned up on fan belts and points. Oh, yeah. I mean, there's nothing worse than having to change fan belts when you're sort of, you know, stuck out in the middle of nowhere. So <laughs> they've twinned up on that, you see. But there's more interesting things, actually, over the other side right. of the car. We'll take a look at that. Because they've got this air cleaner unit and you hook it up there, like so. Wonderful. Which then exposes that so you can get your oil in, you see. Great. So, and also where roll score is, they put on top there that every 5,000 miles you need to change your oil filter, which I thought was great. Yes. To remind me. <laughs> yep. And there's your power assisting top up there. Right. Right, with checking levels. And also here, which I thought was really good, was um, a dipstick, a real long one, so you can actually pull it out and uh, it's easy to get to.